Hello, hello, hello. Hi, everyone. Uh, I'm going to start a little bit early. Only a few minutes. But we don't know what. Who says I have to start at exactly at one? Nobody. Nobody but me. Well, how is everyone? How's their, your morning, afternoon, or night? It's my afternoon just right now, though. So I only ate peanut butter toast. So I might be hungry later. But I do have two water bottles instead of an energy drink which I'm going to try to remember to drink so water not caffeine I'm a little bit more awake today should be good the juice life's juice earth's juice mother's no <laughs> I didn't think that one through <laughs> so let's just let's just jump right into it it's gonna be a chill stream Nothing too crazy. It's Friday. Tired. Well, no, I'm not exactly tired. I was tired yesterday. Not really today in comparison. But, oh, there we go. You know, life just, that's, that's exactly what I want to happen. That's, this is exactly, yep, okay. <laughs> there we have it. You know, sleep or else. Yeah, please tell my body that. <laughs> I just woke up at 8.30 for no reason, and I stayed in bed. <sighs> it's trying to kill me. Also, if you guys hear like barking or boofs or anything, let me know. I left my door open this time to see if my dogs needed anything. Um, but I won't be able to hear them because I have the headphones. But you guys will be. Now oh jeez. Sorry. You can't hear me? <laughs> can't hear me. You sure? Benny, goddammit. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay. Let's figure out what I have to do, because I have no memory of this. Uh, Purgatory, maybe? I know. Yeah, I think it's Purgatory that I have to go to. Right? Oh, right, I can't bump into people because the police are looking for me. Right. I, I honestly I'm super gullible, it wouldn't be that hard to get me. Oh no, I can't I can't fight. I'm sorry. The police. No, stay away. Oh no. Super gullible, probably get me every time if you tried. Ow. Eat it. My foot. Ooh. Got both at the same time. Woo! Come on, throw him. That also works. Keep move. Yes. He's just vibing today. Ow! Stop. With the punchy, punchy, punch. I do have- I think I have to go to the corner store. I can't remember. What do they call them in the states? Or not the states everywhere, but like, no, I'm still good. I can't end like this. Uh, New York, I know they call them something different. Uh, I don't remember. That's okay, it'll come to me eventually. Oh, can't bump into people, I'm sorry, man. You probably know. Where am I going? I don't know. I'm gonna get more stamina this way. Stamina juice. I'm gonna get my juices. Load up on juice. And then go to purgatory because I think that's where I belong. I also don't know how to get into the store. There we are. Oh. I did wiki this chapter a little because I was like, what chapter am I on? Chapter 8, by the way. Um, I need, I need, I'm just gonna buy this kind of stuff because it really boosts my health a lot. Much more than stamina stuff, so. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> I don't know, it's gone. It's okay. On oh, orange? Don't mind if I do. Let me have three of those. Yeah, I'm okay now. 
Yeah, I got the more. Thank you. It's for Christmas, isn't it? Then again, the other corner stores didn't have oranges. We got a chill stream. Yakuza. I did look up the chapter a little. Ah. <laughs> you see that group of people? Um. I did look up the chapter a little. Figure out what was going on. Hi, Sham. Hi, Street. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice that at first. Oops, I pushed it. Ow, ow, ow. I ran into some people. Okay, cool. hey, buddy. Watch where you're walking. Oh, you guys again. Have I beat beat these guys up before? Oh my goodness, did you see that? <laughs> Broke my lower back. Totally shattered. Weak sauce. How dare you? How the hell? What did you do to my friend's back? Yeah, I did. It's just... I'm so strong. Just me being in the same area. It just blew over. Broke all his bones. Later. Where do you think you're going? Oh, hell no. Are you gonna cripple a man and stroll along like it's not your problem? Yeah, I am, actually. Cough up- no, thank you. I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna pay this man. I will fight them, though. Uh? Even the one on the ground. We're gonna dance. I thought I, I thought I taught you guys a lesson last time. Holy- oh my god. The civilians running in the background to cheer me on. I thought they were gonna fight me also, and I was like freaking out for a second. Ow. Fuck of the money. Why don't you guys pay me instead? Like, you ran into me. Maybe I'm injured. That's a new move. My orange! No! <laughs> he coughed up orange juice, though, so I think that's kind of funny. They s he used my orange! <laughs> My healthy snack! Make peace, not war, you know? No fighting. What he said, totally mm -hmm. agree. My juice. Seems it is cured. I feel so limber. Look at him go! Woo! Oh, awesome, man. Must have been a miracle hit that fixed ya. He's still going, okay. Okay, shall we take our leave then? Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. <laughs> okay. I gotta not run into people. Cool. Oh my goodness. You guys see that? My experience points? I have like 200 or something. I should really upgrade my moves. Also, can't run into- Ah! God damn it. How am I not gonna run into people? There's so many. Where am I going? Too far. That's okay. Gotta get new moves, right? I wanna level up. No, they won't even let me go down the street there. I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll level up. Oh god. I feel like someone's gonna jump up and try to fight me, so... Mm. Do I have any for this? Can I, I don't even know how to tell if I can update these yet. Nope. Okay. Not these ones. Increase your heat action powers. Um, I think I have to go here. Oh, I can use them. Then I have to go through the this the long process of just clicking. I want this one. I don't know what it is, but I want it. Isn't life fancy? Nope. This. I wish this is how it really worked. Like I got. 10 experience from working at the job today, so I go home and I like level up my sleep <laughs> ability or something. Give me real life experience. Let me... Okay, I think I'm gonna level up some of the other moves because I used a lot on that. Just close your eyes. <laughs> Said age, it's just XP level. <laughs> Please. Yeah, you know what's funny is humans are the only species that think aging um, makes you weaker. Right? No other species does that. Like, 
the older like you get to a point where it's like you know they can't they're not as strong but like getting to a good higher age is never seen as a weakness in other species it's kind of funny it does at a certain point the mafia man manhandles meanies <laughs> i like that don't have the ability. Yeah. Well, dolphins <laughs> and cows also. And chickens and, and pigs. Great. I'm just gonna go fight more people. No, I'm not gonna stop. Run away. Are they just running into people? Uh, great. I must intervene. Mr. Mafia Man. <laughs> Buddy named Tweed. Dolphins are. They can be good animals sometimes. I mean, not all of them are horrible things. We don't talk about the things that they do, but I'm assured that they, they have good intentions most of the time. I don't personally know any dolphins, but if I did, I'm sure he'd be in quite a friendly person. Nice guy, animal thing. Not a person. Ooh. Oh my god, did you I hit both of them at the same time with my head. I hit that guy in the head and then it hit his head with the other guy's head. The end. Oh, he's scared. Also gave me a tendency to jump off I just yeah. Oh, my Minecraft dolphin. I just can't kill about dolphins. I haven't heard that name in so long. Dolphin apologist. Maybe. Maybe so. My Minecraft dolphin, um, my server. Um, I built- there's this- I built like a little water tank for it and it jumped out of it. Cause, you know, dolphins jump. They have no morals. Well, like, are we grading on a human scale or like- I guess I'll fight the leather jacket people. Are we talking on a do dolphin morals? Like, like, where is the ethics line here? Not my oranges! I didn't buy them to, you know, shove in other people's mouths. Oh god. That annoyed me. Okay, I didn't expect that guy to do that. You, I don't like. Not my other orange! No! Jocted? Yes, they are. They're curious, like, what's that? Let me see what that dolphin did to, the, to a dead fish. Oh, yeah, I have. I know they. They have. They have the SEX for fun. Dolphins are more like humans than we thought. Also not a thing other species do. Not a lot, at least. Okay. Where am I going? I don't remember. This way? This way. Going. Oh, I'm sorry, man. More like grape soda for fun. <laughs> Street ruffians. Dolphins just too wild. They are. the the party animals of the sea. Ooh! I'm sorry. There's four of them! Mother of nature! Mother nature, mother nature, mother nature. Okay. Another one. Welcome. Ow! You made me drop my How dare you! No, stop. Oh my god, he's taunting me. I will do actual murder. Stop. Why are they getting tougher? I don't like this. <laughs> oh, we both missed each other. Okay. <laughs> Let me hit you. Nice. Bonaboos are much better than dolphins. What are bonaboos? 
Do you exchange goods for the goodies? Are they a type of bird? Like a chip? Are they monkeys? Oh. <laughs> I mean... Oh, I didn't make it. This is the right spot. They're one of these. I like the name. Oh no, something's on fire. Is Purgatory on fire? No, it's the bathroom. I would also be intimidated. I heard it was an explosion. Like those apes with red font. I don't think those are called Bonaboos. Less murder than a chimp, but more dirty. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> way to go. They have... Their whole species is known for it. <gasps> no, Haruka was in the, the little tent. The, sh the shanty thing in this place. Oh no. Haruka. Where's Haruka? Yeah, I don't know if they go this far. far. Yeah, chimps will rip your arm off, man. They're angry. Haruka? It was only an hour ago. Date, you had one job. Protect Haruka. She is 10 years old. It's not that hard to watch her. Bo like Burnham. <laughs> no is in no thank you. And Bo like Bo again. Bo no Bo? Bo no Bo? What was I saying? あたし。私。やっぱりここにいちゃいけない気がする。私。綺麗な息子のことを。私。綺麗な息子のことを。私。綺麗な息子のことを。私。綺麗な息子のことを。私。綺麗な息子のことを。私。綺麗な息子のこと
Not my oranges. Good. I don't have any more anyway. Better not be another orange. No, hit him. Why is this guy so good at every avoiding me? Ow, stop, stop it. Yep. There we go. Microchi microchip all children. Or just the ones that get kidnapped often. You know what? It's not even that bad of idea. Like something that can be taken off. Oh great. I'm about to get the point in Yakuza where the game uses BS instead of real difficulty. Ow! What the hell? That hurt, man. I'm gonna punch everyone. I'm not gonna punch you. Ow. You. Ah. Woo. Okay. Little fist. Quick, quick fist. Though I want to grab stuff, so I might change back. Yeah. Nope, this one. Ow. How dare you. After the episode of Black Mirror. Yes, yes, yes. I love that show. I didn't keep watching though after a while. Stop knocking me over, man. I hate this guy. This guy, gotta go. Ooh. Oh my god. Ow. <laughs> episode of Black Mirror, which means we could def do it in real life. I... Yeah, it's totally possible. Like... I mean, they have a way of tracking cows and stuff. So why not children? I mean, it's not the same, okay? <laughs> I'm not saying it's the same. And it would it's not like a bad thing either. You can take it off when they reach a certain age. And maybe they should have like if we're talking about laws, they should have the law the right to like have it removed when they want. Cell phones are Yeah, but like I'm talking children children. Like I, I'm assured I I sure every ten year old nowadays has a cell phone of some degree. But Microchip their clothes. Just be like a secret agent where you're just sneaking into the the laundry, clipping up microchip bleh, microchips. What is this? Okay. Microchip all their clothes, like you write their names on their underwear. Same kind of thing. Same deal. What is this guy's deal? I don't know. Let's say. Let's see. What's the matter? You're shivering. Maybe he's cold. My coat ripped and now it's a big hole. Look, see? I don't I don't know what I can do with that. Wait, where's the hole? Why are we looking down? Microchips are different use case than names on a door. <laughs> <Intro. laughs> like they have tracking apps on phones, but I mean, we're talking about children that This is 2005, guys. We're talking about children that often get kidnapped. It's straight through me. I can freeze to death. I want a new coat, but where is the hole in this coat and why are we looking down at it? I wonder if I could find one. My dad's work shirt had a chip when it had a job? That's almost much more wrong than the children being chipped. <laughs> I'm not going to identify someone by their under- Okay. Yeah. Mm. Probably not at this age, but I mean- but I'm dead on the street, and that's no joke. Honestly, can't remember. No, I'm pretty sure, like... What was I supposed to do for you, man? I don't know. Like, I remember not just underwear had, like, your names, like, your shirts and jackets and stuff had your names on it. I think it's because, like... When they're put away for class or something. Your jacket, not your underwear. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stop talking about children now. Yep, all those holes in that jacket. Am I still trying to avoid the police? Just walk, keep going, keep going. Keep going, I wanna get past you, thank you. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, whatever. That's kinda weird. Was it just cause he wasn't supposed to wear the shirt outside of the job? Or Wait, police like that? No? It's not about not running into people? I thought it was. That would attract attention, right? 
Ah, come on. How is he so speedy? <laughs> One, two, three. I don't know. I wouldn't want to be microchip for a job. Like, I think that's a, a little bit too far. I guess, it, again, it depends on the job, too, because there's probably, like, exceptions. I don't know if it was a tracker or something. It looked like a casino ship. Sew it into that shirt pocket. Oh, you don't... I don't know if it was a tracker, but it was a chip. Oh, I get it. Microchip. I get it. You're, you're punny. This is very funny. Oh my goodness. So what did we learn today, Charm Fruit? Once some microchip children and that dolphins are morally superior to humans. I mean, if that's what we want to go with. I don't see any arguments in chat. Oh, what am I supposed to do? I don't know, lady. Oh, who are you? Hmm? Me? <laughs> you gonna hold your own or brawl? Am I right? You are right. Well, I wouldn't say you're wrong. Then, can you please protect my club? Huh? What do you mean? Well, I'm actually the owner here. And lately, I've had some real pigs in here. Pigs? It's been a nightmare to my girls. The hostesses aren't shy about how uncomfortable they are, but these jerks pretend to be drunk so they can get grabby. <sighs> yeah, exactly. That's why I cut the conversation off there. You know which Final Fantasy is this? Um, 20. The future. 27, exactly. You'll trash the place? <laughs> oh, she's scared. Maybe you should hire security like normal clubs. Instead of just asking strange men on the street that look like Yakuza. Maybe someone can be there when things get ugly. She's trying to hire him, I think. Mm. Will you do it? <laughs> Ultimate Roman numerals. Let's do it. <sighs> Seriously, what are we doing? <laughs> it's just, they've grown up. Japan has just adapted. They're just in the city now. Life has no meaning. Gigolo arc. Exactly. Yeah, it does. Uh. It's the Fs. <laughs> Fear you, by the way. So, when do these men usually come around? I'm sure they'll be here any minute. They usually show up around this time. I don't even know what time it is. There's no clocks in this game. Mm -hmm. It's just always night or it's always day. Oh, here they come. Look at them walk like a boy band. Welcome. They don't even look tough. They just look wrong. <laughs> like that guy with the, the shades and the, the, the sweater vest thing. This is the Final Fantasy Club. It's just Hostess's Club now. Yeah. Well, Boy. hey. What do you want? Have you been acting like you run this place? You talking to me? How is this any of your business? You have no respect for the girls here. That kind of behavior has no place in a cabaret club. You're right, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to be you know's wait wait. Wait, what's the girl's name? There's like in in Final Fantasy, is it you know? Because this is getting weird. Um, White Knight, old man. Well, Chivalry is dead, and you will be too if you don't back off. Why is just everybody obsessed with murder and fighting this ginormous man that looks like a Yakuza? I don't understand it, but uh -huh. I definitely would not provoke. Do you have a death wish or something? Fine. Tifa. <laughs> Maybe. It wasn't there like a Kyrie or something? I don't honestly remember. There's lots of girls. Yeah. What the hell? And they all work in a host club now. This is the future of Final Fantasy. <laughs> no, it's going bad. It's going dark. Um, you have a death wish or something? Fine. Wish granted. I'll break a couple of your ribs too then. Um, I like my ribs intact. Yeah, exactly. Future though. What? No. In reality? In like the games? They're like... Okay, but... All these men are smaller, so... He's tall. <laughs> It's all about relative um, distance. For them, he's taller. Therefore, he's tall. Oh, okay. Just... 
Ooh, ooh, punchy punch. Right in the nuts. Okay, no. Exactly, yeah. I don't know what the average. Whoa, that civilian. Oh, no, I thought that was a civilian. <laughs> I thought he was just super pumped to be seeing this. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know what the average height is, but it's a game too, so. Ha, did I break your ribs? Learn your lesson? Uh, damn, man. <laughs> You better not show your face at this club again, or I'll be here for a refresher. Just like my juice. It's not just... Oh, Benny. Oh, Benny. Who the hell are you? Who are you to Unichan? Ben. What? I... Oh, God. <laughs> That'd be funny. I'm not gonna do that, though. Don't need the drama. <laughs> uh, a bouncer? Uh. Yes, that's right. If you ever show your face here again, I'll be here to show you the door or the sidewalk. How'd you manage to hire muscle like this clan? I'll never come to this shitty club again. <laughs> he did what? What did he do when you picked the boyfriend option? Hi. That was perfect. Thanks to you, I doubt those guys will come anywhere near this club again ever again. I can never repay what I owe you, Kiryu son. Mm. You could just also just pay me though. That could work. I know this is the least I can do. Please take this. Lady! It's mostly the same thing other than a girl reacts to it shocked. Yeah, I would be too. I got an Italian scarf, guys. It's no baguette, but it is a scarf. Tell them that it's okay. everything's okay. All well, well, thanks to you, Kiryu san. Screw your scarf. I don't want it. Give me money. I don't need it anyway. Am I just passing like all of these mini stories? No touching in my streets. Ooh. No. Ooh. How you avoid me? Ooh. Separate. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Great. Oh. It's it's the flannel group. <laughs> at least the at least go give the man free drinks when he visits. Exactly. Like let me have a few Look at all their puffy jackets, though. I like it. They're the red gang. Whoop! I'm not hitting anything. Ow. How dare you. Trash. 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 Ow. Come on, hit someone, period. What are you doing? They're much faster, so now I'm kind of like... I hit a... What the hell is going on? Maybe it's because it's one I... Once I finished that last cutscene, everything just leveled up. It wasn't as hard yesterday, so... Juice. I know. I'm gonna see if I can get through this fight without juice, though. Come on. Can't be free juice. I like free juice. Or are you talking about getting juice at the club? Because both are an option. But I would like to see. Oh, yeah. Is there a restaurant nearby? I'm pretty sure I'm near, like, Smile Burger. Nope. Nope. That's okay. We're gonna have Izuyaka. The Chad move to order juice at the bar. Wait, is that it? It is. Who's clapping in the background? This man right here. I mean, or maybe it's just the winning move. It's, what was the entrance? Like, I don't know if you've ever been that person that gone out to a bar and ordered an orange juice, but it gives you power. It's your party, sir. Like, I drink, but I don't drink, like, super often. I don't drink when I go out sometimes or at a party and stuff, but... Look, is it only drinks? <laughs> I'm not a nerd. I've never done that. I've- I've totally done that. <laughs> I ask only for the final I love apple juice. Apple juice is probably my favorite. Never been to a bar. Okay. That's also- You mean- You mean like- Eventually, one day, maybe you'll experience it. It's not something you have to do. Oh, uh, It's all alcohol. Okay. Yeah, they're just noisy and sticky. Oh, I get to pick food too? This is high class. 
bean sprouts. Just give me a plate of bean sprouts. Man, I love bean sprouts. That's just of terrible people. Congregation, yeah. Yeah, fair. What's the point? If none of them really drink. I mean, like, all, all mine do. But, like, only when, well, dinner and, like, parties. We have a lot of parties. We have themed parties. So, a lot of stories there. I came of age in in a panini. I've never gone out drinking. Okay, what is a panini? We're not talking about the sandwich, right? Because this is all I think about when people say panini, and I'm not actually sure if there's a if it means something else. Let me get a sandwich. Is there a sandwich? A sandwich. I don't see a sandwich. Just 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 dessert. No, I want something to fill up his energy bar though. Oh, this will fill it up. Yeah. Let's get a sushi platter. We're gonna spoil yeah. ourselves. Oh. oh, okay. Right, right. I totally knew that too. I just wasn't 100% sure. I've used it myself. Image. Yeah. I went through a good few years of my life. The good the good times of my life in, in the panini. Panorama and Parmesan. <laughs> Parmesan. Welcome to the panorama. You're not gonna escape. Wait, is that? No, that's not Saya. Explosion, seriously? Is everyone just talking about it? Where am I going? Maybe I'll just go check out Majima. Maybe you'll have a clue for me. Oh, he's a little drunk, I think. I mean, yeah, you're not really missing much. Majima for a bar like they're just noisy and sticky and like the people that are usually there love that kind of stuff which is fine if you do it's about socialization i think mostly now he's gonna pat me down because this is what majima do we were locked down for like a week in america and bars and everything refused to close anyway you know what um ours just got lifted like not completely, but we had like curfews and stuff for certain, like for bars and nightclubs and stuff. I think it just got lifted like two days ago. Safe, yeah. But yeah, no, it was totally shut down. We had a whole shutdown thing for my province, but then also the town Whoa. got shut down because of ice and snow, so. My gym was in the news for saying. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> What a gym. Huh? Yeah, no, that happened here too, some of the gyms, and then. But they got, you know, in trouble. I'm sure, you fight me with proper reason. So then they had to shut down. I love the bread cat. Okay, Majima, you didn't help, help me figure out what I'm supposed to do now. Say. Let's go check out Sega. Maybe I can like... I have no idea. Dibola. Was I supposed to go to Dibola? Or Stardust or something? I don't like that word. Ew, drippy. <laughs> it's kind of like moist. Blech. Um, Let's go to Stardust, see if there's anything there. I honestly have no idea where I am. Okay. This way. It's plenty. Really? Is that the one that they. Is it actually a plenty's cat? Like real life cat? Or like they use as a. Uh, example. Or like. Character or something like that. Whatever the word is. I need more power to you. I actually kind of want to make little emotes of my dogs. I have to take pictures of them, and that's just... Okay, maybe you can tell me what I'm supposed to do. No, I can't talk to you anywhere. Anyone here? No one's here. I'm gonna go back to Serena. Just across the street. But that, yeah, no, that sucks, Dot, having... Or, like, I, I guess you weren't even able to have, like, a birthday or anything, for a party. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Cause especially when you come of age. Like, I think it's... There's just some special dates. Exactly. But with everything shut down, there was... It's just limited. Like, you don't have to go to a bar, but I mean... Like, you couldn't even get together with your friends. Or, like, other family. I don't actually know how shut down the states was. Or, like, depending on state, right? Like, they all have their own different thing. No one was really stopping you. Are you talking about the gym, Benny? Nobody was actually stopping you from going or something? Play games in my room. Yeah. In general? Okay, that's weird. Um, we had- you weren't allowed to actually go out and they were actually- it was just a short period of time where they were checking people that were driving around and you had a card if you were working for like, um, a certain service so like mental health, uh, police, um, that kind of stuff. So they would have a card that they could show people that were like officers that were pulling them over to check if you're supposed to be out and driving around. But that was only for a short period of time and not everybody got checked. It's not like, oh great, who saw me? There they come, it's the red gang. I'm coming of age was weird because my home province, freaking, oh right, yeah. Tricky age was 19, but when I was 18, I moved to uni. Tricky age at Alberta, yeah. <laughs> um, it's so no fun first legal drinks birthday, yeah. I mean, I think Canadians have a little bit different relationship with alcohol in the first sense. Anyway, because our drinking age is a little bit is a lot younger, but I guess that's just you know selective per person. I'm not gonna generalize it that completely, but. Yeah. Look at them walk. Just the boy band of the century. Stunning. It's okay. Alcohol is disgusting. Poison anyway. You don't need to be drinking it. It's not good for your organs. I don't drink maybe two or four times a month. Philia. It's kind of like me. American drinking age restriction is actually... Huh? The, the 21 thing? Very recent, man. What? Oh, bastard. You bet. You bastard. Thomas, please don't ever accuse me of being over. No, no, no. You went to school there, right, though? Yeah, no, I, I would not I would never. I would never insult you like that, Dot. I swear. Because that's the only province that has the legal age of 18. And also driving age of 15. So you could drive at 15 in Alberta, legally. Get your L and stuff. That's all they got. It's because they, they have a lot of farming land and stuff, so they were able to um, get that. So that, you know, children and stuff, or younger families, or families with kids, I mean, could have their kids helping on the farms at a younger age. Yeah, 19. Nope, that's your West Coast brain speaking. So you didn't go? Wait, is there another, another province that has the legal age of 18? I'm so confused. 1984 is when they changed drinking age. Dude, I was not alive then. So it is a long time ago for me. <laughs> well, I got work. Y'all have a good day. Oh, have a good day at work. I got West Coast brain. <laughs> <laughs> it's just sun. Actually, I don't go outside at all, so it's like... I could be anywhere in the world right now. It does not matter. I just beat these guys up. I guess there's two more of them. I'm not gonna pay you. I should probably get more sun. I actually haven't been taking my vitamins either. I should take those. Because I'm not getting any sun. That's why I'm so pale. Great. There's so many of them. You first. We go together, everyone. Watch me dance. Ooh, nice. Sign time. Pop. We dance together. Come on. Oh, I wanted to throw it. Throw him. Oh. But you really want out? Where would you go? Did you turn off all the music? Was there supposed to be music? 
like playing during these fight scenes. I don't know. I might have. I think I turned it down. I think the music's lowered just so that. Because I find it rises during like these fights, but it gets a bit too noisy. You hurt. No, I'm not gonna. You keep doing this, man. What, what happened to your little dance that you did before? Okay. I don't want a parasol. What am I supposed to do with these things that they give? <laughs> like, what am I gonna do with this Italian scarf and this parasol? Oh, the scarf? <laughs> I know, last time I helped with that. That was the last time they pulled one of these ironic schemes. And equipment. Equipment to do what? Could I strangle people with it? Uh, Italian scarves made for strangling. Open the menu. Okay. Okay, I hate it. Stop doing that. Okay. There we go. Valuables. Oh. Oh, I have. I just kept her. Oh, I just kept Haruka's photo of her dead mother. That's great. I have a whole bunch of these keys. Oh, and then my Mezzukin cards. No, on the main thing, it shows equipment. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. Right, and then I can equip it. That also makes. Why do I only have a pair? Of... Why do I have 22 parasols? Is that what it means? Where are my other. Where are my other weapons? Why do I only have this? Okay. <laughs> Thank god it's not actually 22, but why not? Are you sure? <laughs> oh wait, wait, it moved around? Why did it move around? Giant god amulet, binding, gloves. Let's just- he's gonna be super fashionable. But I want to see the other stuff because something moved. I don't know how this game works. You might need to scroll over. How do I scroll? I'm trying. Certain items are accessories, some are gear. Oh, alright, I have to click on the boxes that to show them or something. Okay, but I wanted to find the scarf. Let's whatever. He can be dolled up. It's okay. I'll figure it out eventually, Benny. Street, if you had to pick, what coast would you reside on? Or a coast, not at all, like in, like the middle? What's your preferred climate? It's a, it's a quest item. Oh, okay, so it makes sense. So like, I'm supposed to give it, I'm supposed to give it to other people or something. Like, uh, great. But did you do at least um, something? fun for your birthday then dot i know i was kind of down when i couldn't do anything for mine for like three years two years whatever two years i will intervene you want to get bruised i don't mid-east i've been over there i like it it was an hour or two away from new york okay so not right on the water but you want my birthday last year hmm. It was fun. It does sound fun. A birthday stream. Did, what did, did you play something special? <laughs> He's screaming. Did you hear that guy just start screaming? Oh my god. Let me grab this. Welcome. Oh, welcome. Meet the trash can. Trash. They're so noisy. Why are they so noisy? Not that far away from the street next to him, you're a six hour drive. <laughs> yeah, my gym. Then he just wants to fight everyone. Um, it was almost your fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that makes sense. I can't even remember what I did fully yesterday, so I shouldn't expect others to remember what they did the year prior. Doesn't make much sense. I haven't done any fighting since high school wrestling. Hell in shape. I feel ya. I was I was I was spending a good amount of time at the gym. What? Let's fight. Oh, it's the blue gang. 
Man, now they've just started it. color coding. I haven't gone to the gym since the COVID stuff, but like I had a good routine going down and then it's like, nope. I'm gonna kick you. I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna kick you. Kick. Kick. Parlay. He's scared. It's okay. I'll put you out of your misery. Just some grappling. You know, working out is on, is on you. I know I could do home at home stuff, but routine is where it gets me. Like I need, I need the routine. And plus, I was going with people, so the environment helped me like force myself to do it and getting out of the house and doing it. But. Yeah, go, fly, be big. I'll go back east. Just, just a whole road trip or fly trip. What do you call it when you just instead of driving you take a Oh, an airplane. Airplane. I was like airport. Take an airplane. Oi! Yeah, I don't want to fight you. Round trip. That makes sense. <laughs> We're gonna play a game of punch, punch, kick, and bike. Oh no! Let me hit the. I want to pick up the bike, man. Ha. You want to go on a ride? Meet the bike. Want a wheel? Who? Wait, Mother Nature. She must be involved. Mother Nature, stop! Let me pick up. Oh my goodness! <laughs> this is what you get. A trip. Just in general, a trip. Don't forget heat actions with items. Yeah. They pop up on the car. I, I think I'm getting better at the heat uh, actions at least. Damn, they're so noisy about it. Okay, I'm just back here to ask Date what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. But I did earn some experience points as I went, so that's okay too. And it's suddenly darker in here. Where is Date? Right, I'm supposed to find Haruka, but I have no idea where I'm supposed to look. And apparently everything is fine now. I also don't know where my shanty is. Let me see. Other side of the park, of course. Into the boys' bathroom dimension. Yeah, apparently we've got a whole section back here, guys. This is what really is hiding behind. No, that's just the door. I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. This is a once this is what's inside the boys' bathroom. I'd love to see it. You should see what's in the girls' bathroom. That's why we all go together at the same time. There's a Ferris wheel and everything. This guy was feeding birds, but he also has a dog with him. I respect respect the drip. Also, where the hell I guess. Excuse me, sir. Fuckers and homeless people. Oh. <laughs> this is what is in inside the boys' bathroom. I get it. Fuckers and homeless people. Uh-oh. Badass dad quest. Mm -hmm. For her? Or mine? Look at you. I'm definitely getting some bad boy vibes out of you. Oh, no. Who is she interviewing, though? She's an interviewer. Bad boy. Dressed like a man with real presence. A nonchalant demeanor. That skull says, don't ask me about my dark past. Amazing. Your very definition of a bad boy. I can't. Hey, hold on a sec. What exactly are you talking about? Uh -huh. Hmm? Well, you just look like a cool old guy. Thanks. What the heck is a bad boy? Bad boy old guy stuff you keep saying. I don't know. I didn't beat. Oh, thank you. Honestly, it's been an hour. I've already not done it once. <laughs> I'm too thirsty. <laughs> I should just try not to say anything with inflection. <laughs> You're the poster boy for of a badass dad. Yet you don't know what they are. Bad boys are so in right now. She's trendy yeah. at least. I've never heard of them. This is like when Dream Daddy and Yakuza mesh. 
Yes, it is. Oh my god. <laughs> Try to. He must be the kind of man who becomes a dilf without trying. He just rocks the look naturally. I mean, he's gonna get a daughter without trying, so. They aren't in? So I don't know. Sham likes. What was it? Uh, fuckboys? <laughs> I think that's pretty close. I mean, it could be. I think there's some correlation sometimes. Um, the bad of. The bad and bad boy is short for badass dad and middle-aged man who's dangerous yet dandy. Oh, rugged but respectful. I just said the word dandy. Let's simply put, a cool old guy with a bit of bad boy streak. I see. They're appealing on TV shows, magazines, even in movies. Old man who kick ass have really gotten popular recently. I mean, what was that movie? That... Oh, I don't know. He was like an assassin? And then they went into his house and killed his dog, and then he was like, I must revenge John Wick. John Wick. <laughs> I never would have thought. Oh. Represent. Badass dad, how many years did I age in person? <laughs> Just ten. Not a long time at all. I can interviews for a magazine and article to seek out determine who are bad boys of Kamurocho. Mm -hmm. Wait, there's an actual criteria for that? Mm. Yeah, she just explained it. Interviewing the hottest dilfs I can find and decide- Ow, my elbow. It's still bruised. Um, whether they are truly bad boy material. How do you know if he's a dad or not, though? Just trying to ride the bad boy gravy train. Because it's trendy now. They're not the real deal. But you are. <laughs> I agree, Kiryu. It sounds really stupid. I definitely like to interview you. Interested? Maybe. Me? This town has a ton of bad boys running around the streets. Why not stop them? I call old ladies milfs even if they don't have a kid. <laughs> sure you do. You never know, right? A lot of men on these streets aren't bad boys. They're just bad people. It's too dangerous to talk to most of them. Keep yourself safe. So I wandered into this park thinking I'd be safer and I was hoping to find some more fatherly types here. I mean, in the men's bathroom? Well, if you don't want to do something, the story I'll be, I've been working on for months will fall through, so please help me out. Everybody that he's talked to so far has, like, tried to scam him, guilt trip him, or, like, manipulate him into doing stuff for them. I'll do it. <laughs> Good chunk of your time, is that okay? That's fine, I just want to see what you're uh. talking about, lady. Well, for starters, can you tell me your uh. name and age? Sure. <gasps> he's 37. Finally, we get an age, guys. That means he went in at 27. Oh, he was such a young pup. That's weird. I shouldn't say that. Okay. I just, I'm just used to saying pup because I call my dogs that. It gets into my vo vocabulary. Can you tell me what your priorities are in life as a badass dad? You missed the quest yesterday where they tricked him into Boise to Yaoi game? Oh, I'm so excited to play that. That's gonna be great. He's just- he's just such a nice noodle. He's a good boy. He's- And he's a little gullible. <laughs> My man- the man I interviewed earlier said he makes sure to wear sunglasses all the time, whether it's midday or night. I don't know if that makes you a mad- or bad boy. At midnight? He sounds like an idiot. That's not true. Some people say that sunglasses are the number one must-have accessory for bad boys. <clears throat> Doesn't make you a bad boy if you care that much about representing as a bad boy. Well, whatever. What's my m number one priority these days? Haruka. Yes. Didn't even flinch. Majima. Though it's not really by choice. Uh, Majima sub? Who's that? <laughs> Keeps trying to kill me. What? He's trying to kill you? Did you do something to his family or some other horrible thing yeah. like that? Nah, it's not like that. Once upon a time, I got a little stubborn with him, and he kind of took a shine to me. <sighs> but now when we fight, I can't afford to pull any punches. And he's everywhere, it's kind of annoying. Mm. Uh, okay, I don't really get it, but he sounds uh. like a hassle. Yeah, due to this and that. I hadn't seen him for ten years. And yet, even after a decade, he never forgot me. But he didn't visit either, so I mean, like... Mm. What are we talking about here? How close is your friendship? When I think about it that way, it's not half bad. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell if you guys are best friends or arch en ne nen arch enemies. I was gonna say nenemies. Um, but it's a complicated relationship only men understand, and I think it's lovely. Mm -hmm. Oh, you think so? You bet. 
I mean, your answer doesn't really pertain to what a bad boy prioritizes in his everyday life, but... Man amaze. Man and amaze. <laughs> um, it's okay, why don't we move on uh. to the next question? Sure, okay, then here's that. My next question is... Howdy. Oh god. How the dang old minute. Yes, I'm listening to you kids talk about some bad boys and whatnot. You want a real man? No one who beats the boss. Uh? No one beats the boss. Oh, a bad man boss man, you say? <laughs> I can't handle. You stay put, I'll go fish him. <sighs> he turns around, it's him. <laughs> I mean, what an entrance. Oh, it's the florist, yep. He's got his nip out. Nips out. Surely got a lot of free time on your hands all of a sudden. Well, she practically practically begged me to do it. So you're the boss man that man was talking about? I've been working on a story to find the best bad boys of uh. Oh, you don't have to explain. I've watched the whole thing. Uh -huh. a little creepy. Okay. <laughs> Kiryu is enjoying it. Yeah, exactly, I know. I'm just trying to find Date, okay? These these people are accost accosting me. Accosting me? I don't know. Um, that open robe, the scent of tobacco, I'm sensing an aura of badassery from you that's just as strong as Kiryu's. Mm. Just as strong. May even be bad or bad boy than Kiryu's then. Nani. I can't handle her vocabulary. <laughs> you think? Don't really get it, but why do I feel slighted? I heard my name and started shit. It wasn't me. It was Benny. Well, then I'm going to continue my interview with both of you, Kiryu-san and Mr. Uh. Flores. Oh, great. Now we're both being interviewed for being bad boys. <laughs> Let me know what I'm supposed to use. Oh, both of, you, both of you. You have an uh, interesting bad boy story you can Dang. share? What? <laughs> <laughs> Something like a her heroic exploit? Hi. <laughs> Sham's got the hammer. Mr. Flores, told me about bad boys aren't in anymore. Oh, she cared. Okay, let's see. I was walking in town the other day when a young thug and a woman tried to mug me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Were they targeting you for being an older man? Uh. Yep. But unlikely for him, my job is eavesdropping and talking, uh, taking candid photos, so I aired his dirty laundry on the spot. So stuff like his purchase history of pornography, the identity of his favorite sex worker, and the most recent sex act he enjoyed with said worker. Some real... <laughs> Yeah, no, she's trying to find the bad boys of the town <laughs> to do interviews with. The bad boy boss men. She said, you sick bastard, I can't believe it, then started to argue, and I went along my merry way. He made someone bro break up. That's, that's skill. Spent all of this time becoming a bad boy for it to no longer be in. <laughs> it's okay, Benny. I mean, trends go back around and around, so... That'd be fair, that girl was cheating on the thug with multiple guys. Ooh. What? Can we back this up? Candid photos? Eavesdropping? What's your job exactly? <laughs> oh, do you really want to know? <laughs> yeah, gotta keep her interested, you know? No, I'm just gonna pretend I've never heard all that. But that incident, that incident does qualify you for bad boy status. Okay, curious san what about you? Uh. Uh, I was in jail for the last 10 years, and now I have a 10 year old girl I'm trying to find. I think you beat my badass story. Mm. Bad boy story. <laughs> it's true. But not like the fighting ropes. <laughs> gotta stay my alpha. <laughs> oh my. Gotta stay alpha and on top of my game. <laughs> Went on a rampage at a funeral. He did do that. I was in the joint for 10 years, I beat up punk on a daily basis. I'm gonna do this one. Alpha male grind set? Benny. We got sigmas in the chat, we got alphas in the chat. What don't we have? <laughs> what? That's such a somber, somber time? What exactly did you- Why exactly did you do that? I was falsely accused of shooting someone and got surrounded by men who were ordered to kill me. Sham is the sigma male, yeah. Where's the beta male at? Anybody want to represent? Someone I trust told me to escape, so I, I had no choice. Um, sorry to butt in, but was was this really at a funeral mm -hmm. service? Hmm? Yeah, that's right. 
Um, okay. I get that it was a bizarre situation. Going wild at a funeral isn't being badass. That's just disrespectful. Oh, called out. Who's the link? <laughs> and degenerate me. Degenerates, yes. Then again, based on what you already told me, you're either senseless, senseless or outright insane. Think before you act. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, lady. That's you just read him like a book, miss. No matter- now I'm thirsty again. The whole- the whole alpha beta stuff is- it's all degenerates. We're all degenerates at this point. No matter what the reason, don't go rampaging at a funer funeral service- why can't I speak anymore? I was doing so good. Ugh. Don't go rampaging at funeral services anymore or anywhere for that matter. Yeah, probably Ugh. wasn't the best thing to pick for this interview. <laughs> oh, got you there. Mm hmm? What's happening? Is that Date? Did I- was I really just Daddy. supposed to trigger this cutscene? Mm -hmm. Is that Date? Who's the band that made the song Radioactive? Imagine Dragon. <sighs> Dragon is not so good. <laughs> okay, Shao. Shem, Shem's got the jokes. Just out of on a quick patrol. What are you guys up to? <laughs> yeah, got you three. <laughs> Had the same thoughts though. Though, just being interviewed as a bad boy, old guy. I can't. Huh? Come again? Exactly. This is my reaction every time I uh. hear it. Yeah, this is Date San. He's a cop. Oh, a cop? I'm currently interviewing men for a magazine. Oh, this cutscene. It's just like we're enough of this. I'm okay with this happening though. She's just gonna keep asking men. So you're finding the bass, uh, badass dads of Karamu Orocho. I can never say it right. Uh, yes, older men are in right now. <laughs> Tough guys with a heart of gold, like Kiryu San and Mr. Florist here. <laughs> Aside from teeny boppers to grandmothers are going wild for silver foxes on the silver screen. Now that you mention it, Sai was telling me just the other day all the girls are into old guys. Sai chan Is that your daughter? Oh. Tough guys with a heart of gold. Tough guys? I hope we know her. Yeah, that's right. Hey, wait a minute. Does that mean Sai is into guys like Kiryu and the florist? Oh, sorry, Dante. Mm. Yes, I think that's exactly what she's saying. Mm. Ha. <laughs> I mean, uh -huh. no. <laughs> she can't. I do not approve. Besides, I'm the very definition of a badass dad. You guys aren't bad at all. Nanny. <gasps> You're the police officer here. Soda. Do enlighten us, Date-san. Yeah, tell us how much worse you are than us. Oh, I hear the boofs. Are you anything but a boy scout through and through? Yeah. Yeah, the definition of bad dad more like... No, I'm a loose cannon cop, a maverick of the police force. I'm always taking heat from the chief for defying orders. Maybe the chief just doesn't like what you're doing. I got drunk and failed to meet up with my daughter the other day. Nanny. What? Does that qualify as being a bad boy? If that's the case, uh, I forgot my friend's birthday one time. Cure you! Oi. Oh right, that was Yumi. And then he got her a ring, which she, keep, she keeps losing. So then check this out. I forgot my wife's anniversary. Okay, but your wedding anniversary? What does she have her own anniversary for something? Because if it's your wedding anniversary, it's both of your anniversary, not just hers. Excuse me, if you three are trying to prove how much of a bad boy you are, this is having the opposite effect. Yeah, lady, I don't know what you're looking for. <sighs> oh, our bad. Come on, this is not being a badass dad. It's all about standing up to your up for your daughter, forgetting your or standing up your daughter, for, forgetting your anniversary. That's more bad guy than badass. You got that right. Mm. Hey, Kiryu's just like, I don't have a problem with that. I've just lost my daughter. <laughs> Wipe that smirk off your face. You should never forget your friend's birthday either, Kiryu-san. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing laugh at him. What even <laughs> is this cutscene? Why am I the only one who got yelled at? Boy. Hey, so who among us would make the best bad boy anyway? Huh? huh? Why do you ask? I think we need to decide who the best badass dad is. I think kind of important now. 
Yeah, I can't remember my friend's birthdays either. Well, I do. To a degree, like I'm a few days off usually. Hey, bring it on. Or like the month I get sometimes. <laughs> Good. Then starting now, instead of just sitting around and trying to up one one up each other, we battle for the title of ultimate bad boy. Kiryu, why are you so into this? It's like when dads want to be called cool. Excuse me, but you can't just change my story. That'd be so uptight. Oh, I think it makes more sense if you ask me. When Benny doesn't know your birthday, after all we do. How could you, Benny? You ask me. I mean, it's much more interesting, don't you think? Mm. Mm. You really think so? But I came here for to interview men, not ju uh. I know what that word is. Judicic. No, can't say it though. And then he goes. And how about this? <laughs> is that even a friend? Got hit in the head and forgot. No, it's a homie. Then how about this? You can continue the interview by asking us, each of us a question. That's what she was doing when she was doing the interview. Three of us will answer the question, then he who gives the best answer will get more badass dad cred. Or, oh, I guess all of them are dads, sort of. That sounds fair, don't you think, miss? Yeah. Italy really likes Tifa? Yeah, yeah. It's a homie. <laughs> then it's settled. I don't know a ton about Final Fantasy, though. So I just have to do what I already I'd already planned, which was to ask some questions and get some answers. Yeah, uh. pretty much. Just interview them. That was their conclusion. You can decide which one of us is most worthy for the title of Ultimate Bad Boy. Hey. Works for me. Guys, this was like a point in the first place. Okay then. Use a video of teeth played during an important government zoom call. Right. Oh. Hmm. I love the internet. Then I'm gonna get asked one. Uh, ask the one I've been keeping on the back burner for the end of my interview. Uh, what do you think is the most important thing to a bad boy? Oh, uh, the most important thing is. Hey, too easy. Oh, you're pretty confident, huh? Then please, Floris, go ahead and answer first. And that's how she became senator. Tifa. <laughs> Financial power. You mean money? Uh. Bingo. It's human nature to gain more confidence as you acquire more capita. Capital, not capita. Uh, as self-worth grows your, with net worth, it creates an image of respectable adult male debt. I thought it said daddyism. It says dandyism. Having, bo <laughs> having both makes you the kind of man that girls want and boys want to be. I think I get it. Money leads to confidence and confident makes you dandy. So dandyism is not just about the clothes, it's the attitude of an older, more refined gentleman. You have to go squeeze into some spandex, Benny? It's time for wrestling? Duddle. And that dandy is- oh my god, I can't say things. Dandyism is what makes a badass dad so cool, is that what you're saying? Uh. On a Thursday afternoon. So the most important thing to a bad boy is financial power, see? It all boils down to making bank. A man with no money usually has no confidence. Just look at the homeless in purgatory. Damn, Forrest. Sure, they're good guys, but badass dads, not a one of them. I don't imagine a lot of them have their kids here. So if they are dads, probably not very good ones. I make tons of money underground here. Sorry guys, but I'm confident my lever my level of raw dandyism. Not daddyism. Dandyism is just too high for you two to even compete. Mm. Flores make a pretty convincing argument. Well, I see, Mr. Flores. Thank you for enlightening. Okay. <laughs> ah. Honestly, like, I've spent the last two weeks super dehydrated. So I forgot to drink. Thank you. That's for Reed. That's Teddy's. <laughs> Fair, yeah. Thank you for the enlightening response, Date Sam. Would you like to answer next? Ugh. Hydrate or ditrate? I'm, <laughs> I'm close to ditrate right now. I'm on the lower half of the, the science spectrum right now. You know, florist of Psy? Mm -hmm. What? It's true that financial power is more important to badass dads, no doubt that. But as far as the most important thing goes, close, but no cigar. How would you know you're not even a good dad? 
I'll try. I really, I, I really struggle with it actually. It's like the most important thing to our bad boy. That'd be to have a loving. Maybe show an example, uh -huh. huh? A loving family. You'll see a Lego in the morning signed by me <laughs> after you step on it. I mean, by then I think I deserve it. Man, I don't miss stepping on Lego. What a true, true, cool old dad guy. Gotta, I keep seeing everything as dad. Okay, what a true, cool old guy needs is the heart to love his family and a family that loves him back. That's cute, but where were you when that was important to your family? No matter how much money and confidence a man might have, it's all for nothing if there's no one to share it with. I think... Oh, a boy can only become a real grown man when he has a partner to care for and a family to protect. <sighs> it's it's that dream daddy game. It's getting to me. So a guy without a loving family is only half a man. Compared to a real bad boy, he'd be out of his league. I need Kiryu to like put him back in his place. In that respect, I've got a wife and a daughter to protect. How about you, Kiryu? Daddy. What? Well, I... <laughs> You've got a street cred. But you've never been married. Without dis domestic experience, Junior, it's too early to call yourself a badass dad. I mean, he's not even a dad, technically. A lot of, but a lots of dandy men aren't married. Huh? What? There are a ton of bachelors out there charming all kinds of women, and they've still got some real swagger to them. Oh, 2005, I don't miss you. So I don't think a badass dad necessarily has to be married with children. She's right. You're talking. Well, she's talking. She's interviewing about dilfs in the first place. And you're talking about like you're some kind of respectable family man, but until recently, you weren't getting along with your wife or daughter at all. Yes. Yeah. Well, that was because because you don't go home and spend some time with them. I guess I'm in the clear winner <sighs> here. Bah. <laughs> Looks like the florist has the lead, at least for now. Does does Kiri you have a dussy? that what he has? Because I mean, uh. he's got the looks for it. Most important thing for a bad boy is, not that, having less common sense than normal one. Oh, none of these options are good. At least one good one, please. <sighs> having less common sense than normal men, maybe. But isn't that just like a cute idiot then instead of a bad boy that's I have no clue just gonna be honest here I have no clue uh -huh. huh sorry but I still don't get what a bad boy actually is so there's no way I know what's most important to them uh -huh. oh I wasted all my time interviewing you yeah yeah you gonna take this who cares attitude now eh? sounds like you're giving up on winning this battle oh. yeah Safe to say that Kiryu is forfeited. <clears throat> yes, that's true. He's out. Huh? Hey, wait. <clears throat> Damn. I guess it wasn't a good idea, to be honest. Well, what else was I going to say? Well, thank you for answering, everyone. That's all that's left for you is to declare which of us is most worthy of being called the ultimate bad boy. Hi. Yes. Ahem. Let me make the announcement. Go. Drum roll, please. There's no, there's no rhythm to that. Um, oh, the florist, he won. Woo! Huh? Nailed it. What? Why, damn it. I think Mr. Florist's answer was the coolest and right on the money. Literally. <sighs> that sucks, but it is what it is. Actually, I have a special prize for the florist. Oh, could I have got a prize if I actually cared about this? <laughs> that said, also answer my question. It's not special, but consider a con console. Yeah, I still get something. Consultation prize. Wild shirt. Wait, if I equip things, does it actually show up on my character? Please continue to keep it dandy as the ultimate badass dad. I'll do my best. <laughs> Forever a cool old guy, eh? Well, you actually didn't even raise your child. I'm pretty sure. Hey, okay, I'll try to keep it up. I'm pretty sure he like left his, <laughs> his son with um, what, like an ex-girlfriend or something. Like, who was the mother, right? Because the son didn't even know he was their dad. But he's now married to someone else. I don't know if he has more kids, though. 
I'm sure you do just dandy. Well, please excuse me. Yep. See you around. Hope you do well with that interview in that magazine. Hope you get a lot of... I hope your editor really likes what you got. <laughs> sure it was my natural mag... Magnetism. Uh, I don't care. Maybe you too far to <laughs> learn a thing or two from me, huh? Who knows? You can end up more popular with the ladies. I mean, he is married, but he did forget the anniversary. Whatever. Flora Psy, come on with that. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> anyway, I need to get back to the station. Uh. Yeah. Dihydrate. Ooh. Look at the old guys are currently in, huh? Vibe check. <laughs> are these all suggestions for commands? Because I can make them things. What's all the fuss is about? Oof. I got experience though. Was that the point? Was that what I had to do? Where's Dante? Where'd you go? Got your vibe check. It's the police! What am I supposed to do? Ow, I didn't even run into you. I know there's another gang somewhere, right? Because they took Haruka. So I have to figure out how to get out of here. Again. Hey, you guys are beating each other up in chat. Ugh. I'm so tongue tied today. See, I'm drinking without prompting. Da -da 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 -da. The blue gang? Okay, so I'm actually calling them by what they're supposed to be called. Punk's causing trouble, eh? I don't know. It was supposed to be safe. Who, am I supposed to talk to these people? Hello? Nope. <sighs> Benny, what am I supposed to do? I, I swear, I prop. I don't know. I don't even know. I can't find Dati san because I don't know where the precinct is and I'm pretty sure it's not on the map that I can access it. I already went to Stardust and Serena. I got some food. Maybe I can pawn off my parasol or something. Or go to a nightclub. I don't know. Um, maybe I'll go to Sega. I can do some of the... Oop. I can do some of the... Mini games. I still have Elmo's world stuck in my head. Hey, you. Right in the face. Wait, he has a knife. He has a knife. He has a knife. Oh, no, it's a taser. What the hell? This is the first time I've seen a taser. How dare you? Stop it. I'll not let you tase me again. Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes. I am the Flash. No, he runs fast. <laughs> I don't know. I am Pikachu. I am Pikachu. Leave me alone. Die. I will not forgive you. Static shock. <laughs> Go, Kiryu! Static shock! You remember that, Hira. Ah. Likes it? Oh, it's just someone trying to fight me. They're still chasing me. Are they still chasing me? I don't know. Where is Sega? Down? Nope, this is the bola. It's literally right in front of me. Okay. You're not supposed to be out. You're very drunk. What's that noise? I don't know. 
Club Sega. No, Benny, what am I supposed to do? You've played this game. Oh, okay. Da 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 da. Want to buy this crazy rare bill I got? Nobody's gonna buy that bill. I still. No. I actually just want to get to the store. I don't know how though. I've already been to Stardust. I've been to Serena. Maybe I could try Dabola. I'll try Dabola. I'm I'm close to it anyway, right? Whoop. Oh. oh, I'm sorry. Oh, somebody just told me to. Not very nice. This is Dibola. It sounds like a like a disease, honestly. Can I go up the stairs? Well, let me go. Yep. Up, 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 up. I can't go in the club though. Okay. I should be able to. No. I don't know. Where's the door? There it is. <laughs> should say your current task in the menu. Oh, really? Oh, okay. <laughs> Things I never knew, but I'm almost done this game. I took her a finder. If I have to crush every gang in town, I find- Do I just have to go around fighting people? I'm thinking that's it. Maybe. Let's try. Da -da 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 -da. Still have Elmo Girl stuck in my head. You have to go around and find color gang. Bosses. Okay. So I've been doing the right thing and fighting them. You! Bloody eye. What the hell? Is it just the one guy? Oh, is it the boss? No, there's multiple. Never mind. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh, I just wanted to hit him. Come on, throw him, throw him, throw him. Ow. Ah. Oh, sh that's how I got my, my parasol, parasol, parasol. What the hell did that just do to him? Not that cut. Okay, I knew what you meant, Benny. I knew what you meant. The 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 like the red gang and the blue gang and stuff. <sighs> yeah, you better be sorry. Oh look, our key. Also, where the hell are those lockers? <laughs> On the street, say. <laughs> Yeah, street runs these streets. He runs all the gangs. Da -da -da -da. Okay, this guy is just harassing this woman, maybe? See? Kinda looks like he is. You, back up. Just for the record, your friend is Chinese and my best friend is black. You getting any ideas out there? No, we don't actually believe that, Benny. Don't worry. Mm, about me? I just charge rent. Any, any, any gangs over here? Wait. Oh no, I thought it said I could ride it. I don't care. Go away. Hmm? There you are! Let's fight! I guess that's the gang's name, Bloody Eye? Wait, coffee. Coffee. Ow! How dare you! Ow! Sir, that is- How dare you hit me more times than I've hit you. I just want to pick something up. Let me pick something up. Did you hear that scream? He was just like, ah. Oh god, he has a knife! He has a knife! My knife! Like, parks? Stop, stop, stop! How dare you? 
Is this the guy with the knife? I think. You better be scared. Ow, how dare you. I just want to pick stuff up. So I'll go around beating people up and then I'll go check the park. There's the kids park, purgatory, and then that other area, I think, right? Okay, have one at the gym. Good time. Like here, maybe I'll find- oh! It's empty. All I want is another drink. Someone. Anyone. Mm -hmm. The drunk seems to be really craving another drink. Guess what I have? I don't care. Where- I saw a sparkly thing on the ground. Where- oh, there it is. Mm, more locker keys. Good, good, good. I can give you alcohol. Because I have one thing of alcohol. Boy. I look pretty wasted. I am fine, alright. Uh, just, uh, good, yeah, say, uh. You got any Men. steak, buddy? Ah. It's okay, I mean. Um, sweet. Got some or not, I guess so. I don't think it sucks enough. I made a cool. barrel flower in a playground. Yeah, I don't know. It's nighttime. I think oh. it still runs during the day, though. This town is just crazy. Oh, alcohol, alcohol. Why don't you come back to me? Make him happy. Maybe I'll buy some. Maybe. Last time I did this, the drunk guy gave me, like, some smelly money that was cheaper. Like, less money than what the alcohol actually cost, so I wasn't super impressed. Aizua. What? Over here. I'm waiting. Come here. They're just hanging around. Are you guys good? <laughs> Bike, bike it, bike it. You wanna go on a trip? And a little rocket ship into the sky. Little Einstein. Woo! We go together. Merry go round. This is a ginormous cone. Do you see this? Okay, let me. Give me a second, dude. How dare you? Doogie 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 doogie. There you. Oh, I wanted to finish him with the cone. I don't think it's there anymore. Oh, it is still there. Yeah, look at this cone. It's a great cone. I love that cone. Did someone call me an idiot. What's down here? Oh, it's behind the shops. Any gangs? Anybody who wants to fight? I'm trying to find my daughter. What is this? I can't go in it anyway. It's just playing music. Oh look, cars! I think this is the first time I've seen cars in this game. Besides when they have cutscenes, right? Not bad. I'm sad there's no um, cones around me though. I'm gonna fight you the old fashioned way with my fists. Come on. Okay, turn around. Ow, 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 ow. How dare you hit me? Can't even see what I'm doing. Come on. Ow. No, I was trying to go around him. He's quick. He's got quick fists. Oh, wow, look at that. You're done. This is just a whole bunch of fighting. But like cars, look. It's cars too. You guys sorry? Big. Okay, not gonna make it weird. Can I go in here? It's a club. I want to go in. Yeah, it's kind of. Yeah, I just gonna run into you some more. Sorry. Oh, oh, pink Street. Oh, it's really dirty. Can I go in the candy store? Nope. Okay. This place is so busy, it's freaking me out. 
Okay, I wanna. I wanna you, what do you do? You know, I haven't once gone to this guy that's supposed to like upgrade my experience points or something. He's dressed like a clown on a corner of like of a street somewhere. I just haven't gone back to him. Aha! You guys don't have a color jacket on though. It's white edge, I get it. This guy has a stick. You first, sir. Ow! Stop hitting me. I'm only supposed to hit you. Oh, kind of like that for a second. Where is that pole? Give it to me! Ha ha! Fight, fight, fight! Ow! I just want to pick stuff up. Let me hit you with things. Rude, 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 rude. Stop it! My goodness. Nice. Also, they used all my oranges. That's not why I bought them. Can't end like that? Well, it did. So now, go home. No. Oh! Hey, you. Oh. Hmm? What is it? You're the one known as the Dragon of Dojima, right? I am. It was a long time ago. If that's what you want, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you've got nothing to say to me, I've got some business with you. Oh, do you? Prepare yourself, Dragon of Dojima. We fight. <laughs> I'm gonna beat you up. <laughs> Oh, that does look like I hit him in the nuts, though. Doesn't it? That just... <laughs> Didn't take long, either. Even stronger than the rumors say. The legend's pale in comparison to the man. Who the hell are you? My name is Kano. My dream is to make a name for myself in the underworld. So I've come to this town to prove myself, and I have a favor to ask of you. Nani. Favor? Please, make me your minion. I want, to, I want you to teach me the ways of the Yakuza. No one in organized crime I'd rather learn from. I'm begging you. Please make me your minion. Please. Mm. This guy attacks me out of the blue and then starts in with all this nonsense. Should I let him be my minion? Yeah. I want minions. Like, not the little yellow things, but like this. Whatever this is. Take Drenus to me under your wing, boss. First mission is to get as your minion. I'm going to scout out some prey we can shake down for income. <laughs> Bet the champion district would be a good place to start. I don't want you to do that. Mm. He said it would be his first mission as my minion, but what kind of stunt is he planning to pull? I guess I'll head towards the champion district. I gotta check this out. He's gonna create a mess in my name. I'm not here for it. Wait, great. Are you guys a group? We fight. He's also fighting now. Like I was progressing through the story a lot. Meet my fist. Hmm. Wasn't doing as much fighting. But now it's just a ton of that. Which I'm okay with. Meet my fist. One. Ooh, that finished him. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I thought there was another group down here. Wait, shiny thing. Ooh, look at this building behind. This collapse. Look at this though. Okay, sorry dude. Look at it. So cool. I wanna go in it. Can I go in? No, I can't. It makes me sad. Whoa. I might, where is Champion Street? Pink Street, Sarah, Shifuku. Uh. Where is it? Why did this man go so far? Pink Alley. Is it in here? There it is. Okay. That I can do. Right? Yeah. Now turn around. 
No. This way. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Ah! He's gonna try making money in the champion district. Is he still around here somewhere? Hey, boss. What have you done? I found a golden opportunity for some steady dough. You're gonna be wanting in on it, of course, right? Let's hear it. Let's hear it already. So, there's this real fancy bar nearby. I'm already against it. Pretty sure it doesn't pay anyone protection money, so if we call dibs on that, we could start pulling in on monthly income before the local families catch on. Is that gonna be all called dibs on a bar? That's not how it works. These things go down on a first come, first serve basis, I think. Anyway, let's hurry, sir. God. What have I gotten myself into? A mess. Oh, let's stretch. This is the place, sir. See the bar inside? Maybe the owner, but he's a total wuss. Shellac? Oh, I've been in this bar. Don't drop it through fat, so shape him up. Or, or, uh, uh, shake him up a bit. Gigs are no brainer. What could possibly go wrong? A lot of things. A lot of things can go wrong. Most things will go wrong. Why have I? Why am I walking into this? Ah. Oh. Oh. The Shimano family again. For goodness sake, please just give me a break Man. already. What? Okay, I'll get it. Next time I run inventory, I'll order your associate's hot hand towel. <laughs> if that's what you want, right? <sighs> These demands are so unreasonable, I can only take so much. I feel you, man. What's up with hot hand towels? Can you back up some... Wait, what? You're not from the Shimano family? Yeah. No, I'm not. Well, the Shimano family has been putting the screws on me. And on top of demanding protection, they want me to order these weird hand towels from the so-called company. The audacity. The audacity! The audacity of what now? It's the Shimano family. What family are you from? The bar here is already in our company's exclusive fine hand towels. For exclusive fine hand towels. Best in uh -huh. for all ch Why don't you just... Okay. <laughs> You're done with towels. Should've done that one. You're the one leaving. K kids who have to resort to bullying for their lunch money can run back home to their mothers. Oh, excuse me, pal. You really gonna step to the Shimano family and expect to walk out of here or breathe in? <laughs> Bring it. And the barkeep can mock your, mop your guts off the floor with your own hand towels. With our own hand towels. I'm glad it's Friday. I can't talk. Though I don't know if I want to do it this weekend or next weekend. I do want to do like a late night stream. Just like a surprise one. But I guess if I talk about it, it's not really a surprise. But it will be random. Just keep punching him, I don't... Did I just paralyze this man? I always stream late at night. You do? Ooh. Yeah, I do midday stuff. But I guess it is kind of later for you guys. You okay? Oh, it looks like I paralyzed him. Oh, oh. Fought up. I uh, fought the good fight here. Seeing him beat him down and stick up to the little guy was an inspiration. I'd like to to have this, sir. Gold champagne. <laughs> mm. Nice of you. I'd be willing to buy all the towels in the world. Yeah, that'd be a pretty high stack. Yeah, I kind of want to do like baths or like just something fun and chill. I usually stream at 10 or 11 p.m. and around 2. That's so early, street. Or late and then early. When do you sleep? Well, that was a little weird, but in the end you got some protection payment, so everything is coming yeah. up roses. I didn't exactly go in expecting to do any of that. <laughs> Sir, I think this is the beginning of a beautiful relationship. I'm gonna put my nose in the streets and see if I can sniff out some more business opportunities. Great. Night out, yeah. I am too. This is why I have struggle sleeping. But I struggle sleep. Keeps better himself out of trouble. But okay, experience points, nice. You sleep weird? Do you not sleep or do you sleep upside down? Is there something interesting? <laughs> or you just sleep erratically, like different sleeps. Multiple sleeps, maybe. Where am I going now? Right. Ah, jeez. Oh god. 
Sorry, man, you scared me. Like, actually, though. How do I get out? Let me out. I haven't seen cats yet. Like, I saw cats last time. You sleep crazy? Oh, it's a shakedown. Help me, please. I want to intervene. You do sleep upside down. Confirmed. Street is a vampire. This is why he's up at night, too. The daylight hurts his eyes. Oh, come on, come on, come on. He has a quick fist. Okay. Good. No, I just wanted to hit you with the trash. Like, trash you are. Trash, trash. Stupid trash man. Not garbage men, because garbage men do the work that I don't want to do. But trash. Like him. Thank you so much, but please take this. Battered toughness seat. Sweet. Can't end like this. Well, it happens. Is this guy pretending to play golf? Okay. <laughs> Did he notice me staring and he stopped? Can I go in any of these weird places? How do I get out? Oh! There's a group there. Oh, jeez, there's another one. Come on. Oh, I just wanted to... Woo! Ow! Ow! You hit me in the back. I wanted to grab my parasol, but I actually don't know how to. Yeah, we're all kind of just hitting the air now. That's one way to do it. Finish him. There we go. I can't even sleep sitting up. Like, I have to be laying down. My pillow's too high, I can't sleep either. Just in general, I think, maybe. Oh, I'm right here. What's this thing? Vincent? Maybe I go check out the other um, club. Be hella tired, just sleep sitting down. Yeah, I don't know how people do it. Like some people just knock out right away. I'm like super jealous. I would love to just. Let's go in. I have a friend that just like passes out right away when they want to. The envy I feel. Oh look, something shiny. Hmm. I need to find these lockers. I don't think I ever have fell asleep sitting down. Like, I've been to Europe, so like even a ten hour flight I didn't sleep. Um Obviously pre-COVID. Uh, nothing in here that's useful. Except the key. I got that key. Elmo's world. I really wish that wasn't stuck in my head, but it really is. I don't even know why. Ooh, a butterfly. Can I have it? Can I have? Can I have? Fallen as oh god. Operating class at least a dozen times? Dot is the ultimate sleeper. The hell? <laughs> you have to be tired. White-tailed skimmer. It's the Pokemon-inspired um, card game that children play in this game. You just have to be tired. Dude, I'm always tired. I just have sleep issues. You want help? With the cart? 
Whoa. Are you a gang man? Or are you just wearing a blue jacket? Oh, he is. Do I have to run into them? Okay. Do it fast. Oh, there's more of them. Great. That's one way to do it. Oh, there's a sparkly thing on the ground. He has a knife! No, he has a knife. I hate knives. What do you have? A knife. No! Ow, my back. Oh, parasol time. Ow, stop it with the slicey. Slicey. Hit you with this umbrella. This is what you deserve. No, no. Mother said no. Because I imagine that's who dropped this umbrella. Someone's mother. Is an assumption though. So it's a pretty strong umbrella. Where's the sparkly thing? I saw a sparkly thing. Nope. Back. Go back. <laughs> Should be on the ground. They all just chilling now? Cool. Okay, maybe it's not around anymore. Sad. Great. Yeah, we fight. I'm gonna throw a bike at you though. I like how civilians just run. To check it out. We go on a trip. 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 Take the wheel. Take the wheel. Take the wheel, Jesus. Get out of the way, man. You're gonna get hit. Is it just him? It's just him. Oh, like his soul came out of his mouth. We have getting experience points for all these fights. I'm so I bet you're sorry. I don't know what to do. Great, there's so many of- there's another group over there. Yeah, I'll fight you. How dare you call me that. Wait, I can grab Mother Nature. I love when they scream. They just scream so loud when I do the flower thing. The plants. It's the best. Come on, finish him. Ah, stop it. How dare you hit me. I have to get far enough. Take this sign. To your face. Ooh, I destroyed a plant. I'm sorry. Mother Nature, Mother Nature, Mother Nature. Nice. And the streets were cleansed. I swear there was another group around down here. Just here. And I'm supposed to be like, they were supposed to be here. I'm supposed to be avoided drawing attention to myself. Cartwheel kick. Yeah, these haven't been popping up as often. Striking. It's number one. Maybe I could trade that in with the kids at Sega. Get out of the way. Oh, there's... No, wait. There's the other guys. Yeah, I'll fight you now. This guy has a bat. I want your bat. Or your stick, metal pole, whatever it is. Who just has those like, hanging out? Oh no, I threw it. Where did I throw it? Okay, I don't know where I threw it, so. Mother Nature will help me. I love the reaction. No attention, it's every gang member. I'm not even paying attention. It's good. They all have to go down some way. I will not have mercy. I'm not merciful. What are you doing? Why are there so many people pretending to golf? Concerned. Uh, it jiggles down the way. So I go down hills. Oof. Oh, great. There's another one. How many groups? Oh, he's a big... God. Oh. Oh, finish him. 
with my fist. Oh, it did finish him. Nice. Cone time. Cone. Welcome to Cone. Into your life. The name of the later day saints. I don't know. <laughs> What's your guys' plan for the weekend? What do you guys got planned? Any big any big plans? Any games? Any, any chilling out? Dot, you got any streams you're gonna be doing? Oh, I don't wanna go back up the hill because I'm just there. You work all weekend? Fun life, you know? Yeah, just the working life. It's where you gain experience points. D&D on Sunday? Nice. How do you play? Alright. Okay. How do you play it on- s are you talking on stream or just like with friends and stuff? I'm wondering if there's like- Oh. Cool. Uh-huh. Oh, Circuit Stadium. I finally found it. Blue Bird Cup. One of my friends' name. Okay. I was gonna. I was gonna ask, how, like, does D and D have like a video game or like a platform web browser platform thing that you can play off mm. or something like that? But I've never played it either. So feels like yesterday I was aiming to design the fastest racing machine. Okay. Wow. This is his past. Racing against my rivals, customizing cars like crazy, those were the days. Wonder what all those kids are up to now. They're ten years old or so. And they graduated and moved on to better and bigger bigger and better things? Probably. Oh far out. I know that profile anyway. Mm hmm. hmm? Kazuma come? And you must be. Oh Yep. It's me. <clears throat> Actually, I have no idea. Their website is exists to help you play with a paper dice and zoom. Okay. I can see, yeah. I can see someone making that for that purpose, especially with all the COVID stuff going on. Hey, come on. That's way harsh, Kazuma-san. Oh, my pocket circuit fighter. The racer who does live commentary at the po pocket circuit stadium. I was kidding. Of course I remember you. I don't. He looks so young and fresh-faced. No, he doesn't. It's been a while, fighter. Dude, you really had me going there for a sec, Cosmokun. But man, I'm glad to see you again. Hmm, me too. It's been a while since anyone called me Cosmokun, that's for sure. It's been 17 years, in fact. Uh. Literally, people call you that all the time. Uh, anyway, if you're gonna keep chatting, let's take a inside pocket circuit stadium. Uh. The old digs. That's a good idea. Okay, mini story. Side story. Oh. Oh, I look so cute. Is this where all the kids mm. go nowadays? Never know, it's been 17 years. Crazy. Does it look exactly the same, Julie? Time flies, doesn't it? You suddenly stopped showing up, so I wonder what hap happened to you, Kazumakun. Oh, uh, I got busy, you know, and I just couldn't find time to come by. I see, I see. What about you? You didn't tell him you went to jail for 10 years. <laughs> Have you been commenting? Um, commentating on the races ever since I left. Yeah. Actually, a lot happened on my end too. I was scouted by the pocket circuit lead for my live commentary commentary skills to liven up the game all over Japan. Man. Seriously? That was great. I guess so. Bashful. Mm. Devotion paid off, eh? You used to work as a part timer and make a measly 850 yen per hour. That's eight. No, that's less, I think. But now you must be pretty high up in the ladder. Cool. Wait. Why do you look away? Actually, the company finally recognized my efforts also, so they offered me a full-time position. Oh, so someone did notice your hard work. Yeah. But then I failed the written exam to become a full-time employee. That's so sad. The hair behind the ears. Is there a result? I'm still a part-timer. My hourly rate's up to... Oh. Oh, I see. I like the music, it adds the ambiance. <sighs> 
so shy. <laughs> Wages have only gone up in 17 years, so his annual raise was 10 years, 10 yen per year. That's a little sad. That really is. <sighs> it's almost criminal. I'm going to reunite after 17 years, and I've already made it awkward. I better say something to change this subject. You better. <sighs> oh, I just want to be out of this conversation, really. Why don't you try a full-time position again? You still have your skills and your fighting spirit. I think you have a shot if you study hard for it. I want to do that, too. But once you fail the exam, it takes you to earn the right to attempt it again. That's stupid. Oh, really? Yeah. I have no clue when I can take the exam again. Why do ask? I have to study harder back then. I should, I should have. Damn, this is really getting awkward. Maybe that's what happened. And it left me to really think hard about my future. What do you mean? Well, actually, I have a fiance. Nanny? That's like the shocking thing. You're engaged? Seem uh, kind of surprised by that. Uh. Of course I'd be surprised. But I get it now. You finally found love, huh? For sure. I met her while I was traveling around all around Japan. Everything really does happen for a reason. I used to be, get teased about having no experience with the ladies, but I guess you finally become a man. Oh, actually, my fiancé is a little old-fashioned. We're not doing anything uh, like that until we're married. Er, that wasn't what I... <sighs> that was fine. Oh, it just keeps getting awkward. More and more awkward. Problem is, when I went to ask her folks for the blessing to marry her, they turned me down. Oh, goddamn, sir! I believe the act were, exact words were you expect us to give your daughter to a guy who can't even find a full-time job? Part-time or not, you've achieved so much as, a, as the fighter, and the kids really love you. You're better father material than I am, really. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we still don't know where ooh, still don't know where Haruka is. The status of being a full-time salaried, salaried blah, blah, employee is huge to them. Having it or not makes a big difference. Hmm, I never knew. Your fancy parents are old-fashioned too, huh? Ugh. Exactly. They really care about these things, but if I let the opportunity pass by, I don't think I could ever marry. Besides, I think the world needs a new pocket circuit fighter. Anyway. Mm -hmm. New pocket circuit fighter. That's right. More and more young racers are getting into the pocket circuit. I think the company needs to bring in a new blood to keep... Needs to bring in new blood to keep the, itself going. It really does care about the future of pocket circuit. This is... I don't care. Um, so when I find my replacement, I'm going to retire and take over my family long-established tofu business. That'd get sure approval from the fiancé's parents. I'm pretty sure that would. I guess that makes sense. But as you know, pocket circuit is super important to me. One could say it's my entire life. I can't just give the position to any young punk off the street. I see. So I'm looking for someone who loves pocket circuit and could put as much passion into it as I do. I'm not. Don't ask me to work here. I will not. I love it as much as you. Yeah, not an easy qualification to have. Plus, I've still got my job as the current fighter, so I haven't really had time to go out scouting for new candidates. Do I have to do that? I can see you're concerned about your future. It's true. You're at a major turning point in your life. Yep. And I think it's fate. We saw... No, please don't ask me. No. Yeah. Nope. There you go. Nope. <laughs> Love the straightforwardness. I think you at least help me find something worthy of being next generation pocket circuit fighter. Many. fighter. I'm going to look for your successor. Yep. With someone you recommend, I'm sure he or she could be trusted to take the finals. I have an idea. That kid in the Sega play, like, uh, game place. I'm not asking you to look for game someone right now. I'm sure you're busy doing your own thing. I am. Very busy. I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing. I'll be at the reception desk here, so come talk to me again uh. sometimes. Okay, sure, sure. Got it. New mini store. Sub stories, I guess that's what they're called. But I just wanted to look around a little. Okay, I guess not. Oh, look! Something shiny. More keys. I have to find these corn lo coin lockers. I have no idea where it is. I don't want to race a car. Oh well. Ugh. Now loading. Well, there's these people here. What? Are, what? You okay, dude? <laughs> Is he vomiting? Boy. 
Hey, what's the matter? You're Yakuza, aren't you? Yeah. No. <laughs> May have the look, but I'm not Yakuza. Uh -huh. Shut up. I don't want to hear your lies. You came to get in my way again, didn't Dead. you? Hold on. What? Not a chance, Yakuza. I'll kill you for trying to ruin me. Ugh. Oh, it's civilians. I have no idea. Menacing man. Is he really? It's not gonna take much. There we go. He's done. He did a somersault. He's a scum. If you're gonna kill me, just get it over with. Calm down. You're frantic. I don't know how to convince you, but I'm not Yakuza. No? You're a liar. Just, you're just like the rest of them. What would I get out of lying to you? Besides, I don't even know what this business deal was. Oh, sorry. Hey. Did they make you this afraid of them? Well, you see, I had a new opportunity lined up, but it was ruined by those good-for-nothing Yakuza. It was very important business deal that was going to put my career on the map. Thanks to those thugs, though, the negotiations were cut short. Interesting. The Yakuza usually don't interfere with business deals unless they have... It's really lucrative. What happened? Well, I guess they were interested in my company. Even asked for a partnership with me. Hell, if I didn't know any better, I might have fallen for that fake hmm. company name. I want my business to be legitimate. That means not getting in bed with the Yakuza. <laughs> so I rejected the offer. I had to. Now I'm seeing the picture. For being targeted in relation and retaliation because you wouldn't make a deal yeah. with them. Yes. You see why I despise Yakuza then? Yakuza? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I can at least understand the situation. Good enough. <laughs> Look, I know it was rude to you before and I don't deserve the answer, but could you uh. tell me your name? Don't sweat it. My name is Kiryu. Kiryu-san? Got it. My name is Yoshioka. I'm really sorry for mistaking you for Yakuza. I'll admit, I was surprised when you questioned me. Really? The people have been doing it all night. Like, countless numbers of people. Groups of people, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> These people, also. Yoshioka. I can't even. I just forgot how to say it. You're a little dear the other day. How, how, how dare you? Care to introduce us? It's them, the Yakuza who sabotaged my business deal with a bunch of, bunch of nasty lies about me. Ugh. Oh. Damn, you're getting stuck on the Yakuza BS. Get it through your head. You didn't even swear? You just said BS? <laughs> That's cute. <gasps> Get it through your head. We're not Yakuza sabotage. Please give me a break. All I did was have a conversation with your friend that day. I mean, wouldn't you want to know if a person when you were going into business with was a ju judgmental nut job? You gotta be wary of people who accuse civilians of being Yakuza. Oh, I'm sorry. We were talking about your little deal. So, it fell through, huh? Aw, that's too bad. You intended for it to fail. You knew this would happen. It's getting dramatic <laughs> here, guys. Whoops, was I that obvious? Damn, cats out of the bag. You Boy. allow me. Huh? Hey, guys. Mind giving me a moment of your time? What? You got a problem, big guy? Uh. Yep. Guys like you need to learn not to meddle in the affairs of other people without so much as to care about how it affects them. <sighs> Boss battle. I think you're the one to teach us, huh, boss? You'd be surprised how convincing my fist can be. I love his one-liners. Huh? It's art. Do you have any idea who you're talking to? Here's a lesson for you. Underestimating me isn't good for your health. I'm guessing because my health will be dead. You're gonna eat your words. That's gonna be really healthy. Just a little snack, you know? Look at me go. Trash, 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 trash. You next. Ow, how dare you hit me. The easiest boss battle. Exactly. Sustenance. You're gonna regret causing me. Okay. There we go. Look at them just pop up. Little jelly beans. Mm. Oh, he left a card. Now we can find out what president business card company it is. Or Yakuza group it is. Yakuza. Oh, Kiryu-san, thank you so much. I don't know what I would have done without uh. you here. Don't sweat it. <sighs> feel terrible. Though I judge you on your looks and then attacked you for it, yet you helped me. We're fine. Nothing to lose any sleep over. But you probably should know that guy wasn't Yakuza. Eh? What do you mean? Here. Or you see for yourself. Looks like he's just a guy with a real mouth on him, but a real business to go along with it. No way. How could I be wrong about him, too? Might not mean much coming to me, but you shouldn't judge a book by its cover. I understand, Kiryu-san. You're literally from the Yakuza, though. That's why you look like... 
Oh, I'll do better. Take this as my apology or thank you present, whatever. Okay, just give it to me. Red jewel. I'm gonna go to the pawn shop. <laughs> you must. From now on, no more judging look books. Books by their covers. You've shown me that people's actions are what really matter. I guess if you really read by read between the lines, what happened today was my fault. Yeah, that's already some good progress then. All right. Yatta. <laughs> Tomorrow will be a new chapter for my business and a new chapter for me. I have a long way to go, but we can only turn one page at a time, right? Look at him go, my little star. <laughs> the book metaphors, but maybe it's just reading too. Ah, puns, but maybe I'm just reading into it too much. He laughed at himself. Oh, I love that. Yes, experience points. Okay. I think it is about oh, time. Oh. Nope, I have to go around. For me to oh. save the little rock star. I love that um TikTok voice. What do you call it? The music thing. But I think Oh, oh, exit that. Thank you. I think it is time to say goodbye to Yakuza for the night or the afternoon or morning, whatever time you're at. It is time instead to do a raid and say hello to something even better. Uh, thank you guys for coming, though. It was fun. It was a good Friday. I'm getting through Yakuza. I should hope I'm close. To finish and maybe close to finding where Haruka went because she's been yes that's I was just gonna is she going oh she's not Sarabara what did I say Sarabara um I'll check though I know I'm saying a lot of things so it don't make sense that's okay Well, I'm, I'm, I don't know. It's always good. Yeah, why not? They're doing well, a three, I'm, day I three, it's always good. two streams. Co-stream. Oh, cool. Yeah, thank you for coming. Thank you guys for showing up, um, sticking around, having a chat, enjoying Yakuza. Um, Tonka, how are you doing ah. today? I got audio playing, sorry. <laughs> it was fun. I have all my VODs. I'm actually kind of behind on uploading those VODs to YouTube, but I'm getting there. Um, and my Twitter is where I update things. And again, I might do a surprise stream, like a late night one this weekend or next weekend. So um, follow my Twitter to find out when that will be. Have a good day as well, Street. I'm actually going to raid her because why not? And they're doing a... Uh, a split a stream two people i think that's really cool bye dot let's get this raid going six five four i have to count down two one bye I actually wanted to go and be um, um, a forensic anthropologist.